this shit could be Christmas every day. No, I don't. Can you imagine having Christmas every day? I mean, that would be a flipping nightmare. Yeah, I really wouldn't want Christmas every day. One, it would cost a fortune. And two, you'd be shattered, wouldn't you? <laughs> Can you imagine having to buy a present every day? Oh, or presents, no. Anyway, welcome to Vlogmas day five, I believe. Is it the fourth today? Yes. So that's confusing for you, but it's not for me because I started filming on the last day of November. So yeah, it's day, Vlogmas day five even though it's Sunday the 4th. <laughs> right, let me show you what Naughty Pippin and Reindeer With No Name have got up to. So they decided to play Twister in the night. So Pippin's in charge of the spinner and you can see it's on blue foot. So Reindeer With No Name has got his foot on the blue circle. Elf spinner, yeah. They're having a whale of a time there. Oh, and an FYI as well for you. So, I had a, a message, like a, a DM, um, and it wasn't nasty, but it was making comments about my decor. That sounds like it's nasty, but it, I don't think it was intended to be nasty. But all I'm saying is everybody's different everybody has different decorations everybody has different tastes and likes and as someone pointed out to me too much of something could cause your fibro to play up so anyway what I'm trying to say is try to think before you speak or you message like try to think how you would feel getting the message that you're sending does that make sense um, I'm always doing that. I think, right, how would I feel if I got that message? So, always try and, and think about that. Because words can hurt even if they're not meant to. Do you see my point? Anyway, you do you and I'm doing me. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. So, what are we doing? What are we doing? So today, we are, me and Mark are, going for a roast dinner at my mum and dad's which would be lovely oh I've got to get some games sorted out should we go and do that actually before we sort the games out I was going to open my advent calendars with you oh my god it's carnage out there it's cars and vans and stuff everywhere right so it's day four so let's have a look which is good because I'm starving four but I don't want to eat too much because um, obviously we're going for mum to mum's for a roast. So, oh, I can't get it open. There you go. What flavour we got today? It's just an original, I think. Just an original, which is lovely. So that's that one done. Put that back. Get the picture one. I might treat myself to a new picture calendar next year. <laughs> So to keep closing the doors up. Uh, number four. And it's a bell. The bells. There we go. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. So we've got our sweetie. <coughs> right, let's go and choose some games to take to mum's. And then I think I'm going to get some fruit and a cup of tea. Right. Let's have a look in our games cupboard if I can get down here, which is a bit tricky. In a games cupboard, we also have the cutlery sets that I bought. Um, I mean, I would take scene at Harry Potter, but I've got three people that aren't really Harry Potter people. So uh, what else have we got up for debate? I think they would get confused at that, to be honest. We've got Uno. We could play that at the table, I guess. Christmas, would you prefer? We could take that. Um, it's an absolute mess again. Because um, I've got so much stuff in here. Look, I've got even Halloween candles. Oh, what about the best of Christmas game? Let's take that. That's a good one. We'll take that. It's upside down now. 
the best of Christmas. It's a good game, that. So we just take them. I think that will do. That will do. Uh, if you'd like me to go through all our board games that we have and we play at Christmas, let me know in the comments. Let me, hang on, I've just got to try and get <laughs> Oh, God. Um, let me know in the comments and I will do that at some point for you. I'll go through a list of board games. I was also going to go through a list of uh, Christmas films that I've been watching because I, I struggle with getting good films. Like the Hallmark films, some of them are utter trash and others are really good. <laughs> so I thought I might make, start making a list of all the good ones for you um, and do that one day. So I've got a busy, this week coming up, right, is so busy, it's ridiculous. Let me take you through <laughs> my calendar. <laughs> So tomorrow, I've got to go and get my eyebrows sorted because you can't see it because I've penciled them. I'm starting to pencil them again now. But where she um, did like a touching up, the colour wasn't the same as my eyebrow originally. It was a lot lighter, so it looks weird. But also, I'm now having to pencil them in again. And I shouldn't have to do that. So I think they need to be darker. So it's difficult because it's free. I like I won it. I won, I won a lot of competitions at the moment, don't I? So I can't, you know, say too much. But she was the one that said, "I'll oh, come in and I'll have a look at them." So I've got to get that done tomorrow. Then I've got to go and do loads of like picking up stuff. So I've got to pick some bedding up at Argos. I've got to pick a next thing up. I've got to go to asda and get some better christmas eve boxes because ours are rubbish and they were two pounds each in asda um and i do want to make some christmas craft tomorrow but that's if i get time and energy to do that and then tuesday um i think i'm going over to mum's to do her shelf of dreams and maybe lunch and there's other things going on as well wednesday i'm having lunch with my friend sarah Thursday is like the food shopping and that hour, you know, editing sort of day. And then Friday, I'm back at Lakeside again <laughs> with um, Mark's mum and Holly because we are shopping for Holly's birthday. Holly's birthday is the 13th of January and she's going to be 21. And I think she wants some clothes and she wants a coat. So she's, we're going to, the three of us, go and and get I think we're, the reason we're going to Lakeside is because she wants the, the Zara shop and that isn't near us so we're going to go and do that and that's another week done oh and I'm painting on Saturday I've got to order that actually I might do that in a minute order something to paint <laughs> here we go I can hear jingle bells <laughs> mum's got a Christmas jumper on Hello. these are for you Thank you. That's <laughs> a long time. There you go. Okay. Carrots. Yeah, it's fine. Thank you. Some Dishing up the dinner. Here, look, <laughs> My camera's going to steam up. <laughs> Mum's on the gravy. Yeah. <laughs> that doesn't sound good, does it? <laughs> 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 Green beans. Green beans for you. Yay, my favourite. I'm sure they will be. Thank you. <laughs> Can you stand a spoon up in it? <laughs> no, but we need a knife to slice it. <laughs> slice the gravy. <laughs> Now's a classic uh, question. Mark, do you want stuffing? <laughs> I'll leave that dish there. Oh, cauliflower cheese, Mark. It's cauliflower cheese. Is that one? Yeah, okay then. It's gorgeous. I'll leave that there Just because I might need some more gravy. I need two plates, huh? Yum. Do you make it yourself or do you no. buy it? Esther's finest. 
Is it Asus or is it Audi's? No. It's fine uh, for me. Audi's fine, it's here, you're right. Lovely. Do you want match? Um, that's fine for me. Yeah, oh, mum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A little bit, just a fraction more. No, not quite as much as that. Oh, my God. <laughs> So what was? <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa, Sabbath. Steady. Don't forget Mark. Right. Yeah, he's got yeah. some. Finish it. Finish him and finish it. Oh, we've got room for the Yorkshires now. Oh, Put them on no. top. <laughs> you got the stuffing balls yet? Yeah? <laughs> I think it's just near Mark, isn't it? Yes. Now that is a small lemonade. <laughs> Jeez. It's tiny. One sip. Yeah. I can't do it. Don't know what you're doing now. <laughs> what have you done to it? I've got my finger in the camera, Nick. <laughs> my finger. <laughs> I thought, what's that blob in there? <laughs> the Mark's Yorkshire's on top, I love it. Look at that. Eat that if you can. Welcome back. <laughs> right, it's finished then. Oh, I can't go now, Mark. Oh, so I thought I was doing you a favour then, because I get getting told <laughs> off. You certainly do. Oh dear. Oh, now we've got any red. Blue. I'm trying to help me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm cheating. <laughs> She's looking at my cards. It's punishment for that. Thank yeah. you. Oh, yellow. Yeah. Yellow, yellow, that, yellow, yellow. That'll teach you. Oh, well, definitely no option. You've got two cards. None of them are the colour that what colour on there or the number. Yellow. Oh, yellow, no. Colour red. <laughs> red colour red. Well, who knows? God. Who's going now? Yours. You. Don't put your other hand. Don't put your other hand, whatever you do. Sorry, Nick. That's all I've got. Ooh, vicious. When it comes down, the oh, blood ain't thicker than the water, you. is what it? What colour, Mum? Oh, uh, blue. Sorry. Oh, for Christ's sake. What? Are you stupid? <sighs> I can't hold all my cards. <laughs> I thought it was a good choice. Oh, it's for you, yeah. very dark <laughs> very eerie so we're back from mum and dad's now and I thought I'd take you outside and show you the Christmas lights because I haven't done that yet have I so let's pull the door to so we don't lose all the heat let's go and see the Christmas lights oh there's a little glimpse there's a little glimpse oh. right so here we go we've got the Snowflakes hanging up in the windows. We've got the new cluster lights on the apex and the um, stars. So that's what the windows look like together and the lights. Yeah, I think it looks pretty. Right, let's, co oh, let's come back in because it's freezing. Actually, I've got to water these trees. I haven't done that yet. Oh, it's so cold. Happy, what is it? Monday. <laughs> it's Monday. Um, I'm just about to do my makeup, so I thought I'd talk to you while I'm doing it. Do you remember when I sorted out my um, makeup drawers? Well, they're getting in a mess again. So we might have to do that again, you know. It won't be as bad as they were before though, but it's just certain areas are getting rather messy where I'm chucking things in or getting new bits of makeup. So how are you today? Last night I was in so much pain. So I had that lovely day at mum and dad's. We played games. We uh, had a lovely Christmas dinner and I think it was because I was sitting down not doing very much because I don't know about you but I have to do a bit of both so I have to obviously rest but also 
get on with things and move and if I don't do the mixture of the both I'm in a lot of pain so yes that was painful last night and I didn't want to sit down but I didn't have the energy to stand up so that's always nice and this morning I've had a little bit of a lay-in nothing major so I am going to work through my list like I probably explained yesterday but I'm not going to eyebrows now because she cancelled it because her little boy's ill so that's fair enough so instead that's quite handy actually because it gives me more freedom to get on with what I've got to do so I'm going to go to Sainsbury's first and because I've got a voucher I think it's £7.50 off if you spend over £50. Anyone else get that? All the makeup goes on the top. I need like a bib. And I, Mark and I said, well, let's go and get all the Christmas drink because now obviously Poppy will have a drink, Holly will have a drink, and we'll have a drink. And then we've got 10 people, no, 12 people in the evening, Christmas Day. And we've got Angie's day as well so we need and we've got the Strictly party coming up so um, yeah I'm just gonna go and get all that and I'm also picking up a duvet cover I'm probably repeating myself here from yesterday and I will show you that I've stripped my bed because I've had that that woodland animal one on there for a couple of weeks so I, I change my bed in every two weeks is that wrong is that gross that's what I do um, if it's in the summer and we sweat we're sweating obviously I change it more but in the winter I don't think it needs to be done as much and that to be honest that's enough for me anyway because changing a bed uses a lot of spoons so I'm gonna go and do that and then I've got to go to next and then I've got to go to Asda and just pray that the Christmas Eve boxes are still there that were two pounds each otherwise our Christmas Eve stuff's going to be a gift bag it's not that it really matters and that's my day really I'm going to come back and hopefully do some craft if I've got enough energy and I've got enough time I want to make today there's a um, snowman disc decoration so do you remember for those of you that watch my vlogs avidly is that the word don't know um a while ago i went to for a walk in the woods to collect some sticks and i said to you i need to dry these out for some christmas craft well that's what it's for um so i will hopefully be doing that later and i will show you obviously and yeah that's just the plan i'm just cooking myself some lunch because i know that when i'm out it's going to be probably lunchtime while i'm out and i might want my lunch and i don't want to then go and buy a calorie um filled sandwich when i've been doing really well having my little bits of party food with salad so today i'm cooking five pieces of nacho cheese chicken which is from Aldi's and I'm gonna have salad with that so I will take that with me see I'm just having to fill bits of my eyebrows at the moment where even my makeup touches it or it's just not tell if the thing was up it's just not dark enough which is really annoying but there we go um so yeah that's the plan today right where's this one sainsbury's done it's too peopley out there <laughs> far too peopley so i've done sainsbury's um that was a mission let me tell you i couldn't scan i was getting a like a box of Prosecco of six bottles and I couldn't scan the box and I said to the woman that it won't scan and she said oh no you need to do each one individually so I'm like oh. so anyway Sainsbury's done just went into next 
the escalator was broken and I had to go upstairs for picking pasta. Anyway, done that. Um, but everywhere's just so busy. I know it's like December and people are just panicking, but seriously, it's the beginning of December. You've still got time. <laughs> it's only the 5th. <laughs> but anyway, I'm now going to Asda to try and get these Christmas Eve boxes. And then my lunch is calling me. Like, it's only 10 to 12 and I'm starving. But I'm like, no, I'm going to do Asda and Poundland and then I can sit and eat my lunch knowing that I've done everything and then I can just go home and unpack everything and do my craft. My knee is hurting. <laughs> oh, it's just happy Christmas, isn't it? Happy Christmas. Right, I'm finished. I'm done. I am done. I'm done in. I don't know about anything else. Poundland didn't have what I needed, but I did get a couple of bits from there. Um, right, I am going to have my lunch because I'm starving and I've prepared it. So let's sit here and watch, just trying to gel my hands, watch the world go by eat me lunch and then go back and try and unpack this lot before I can actually do some craft. I'm having a car picnic. <clears throat> oh and there was a, a story in about Asda. So I went in to get the Christmas Eve boxes because our ones have collapsed and Asda was selling them for two pounds each. I have to show you my lunch. Look at that. <clears throat> what a lunch box. Yeah two pounds each so I was like Actually, I should have thought of this and cut this up. I'll have to cut it up with my fork. Um, and I was like, okay, I'll go and get them. But there was one left on the shelf. So I asked this lady and she did a call out for this bloke twice and he never turned up. So she said, I'll go and see if I can get them. And anyway, she found a bloke to go and get the pallet. And um, he got them, but it took like 20 minutes. But I said to her, oh, thank you for your... Um, for your patience uh, no thank you for your help you know because <clears throat> she was a big help so i managed to get them but i said how crazy it was right i'm home thank goodness for that <laughs> she says so i got two boxes of budweiser which was um or budweiser or however you say it it was two for 20 pounds so that's like, there's 20 in a box. So what's that, 50p a beer? You know, really, really good. And then I've got six bottles of Prosecco for 24 pound. Um, I'm out of breath because I've just taken all this from the car. Pepsi Max, that will be drunk now. We'll have to get some more of that before Christmas. These are the Christmas Eve boxes, two pounds. Aren't they brilliant? Um, Oh, and I have to show you what I bought Poppy and Kaylee, um, which is this gonk, because Kaylee loves gonks like me too. And um, she hasn't got one yet, so I thought I'm going to put it in Poppy's room because they're staying Christmas night and they can have a gonk in their room. Um, more booze in there. <laughs> oh, this is the duvet set. Oh, everything's going to crash. Look at that. Look how festive that is. So I'll show you when I've put it on the, the bed later. But that's the Christmas bedding. Put that in there. <laughs> um, I got these. Oh, these are my favourites. They are like um, Frere Rocher, but they're white chocolate coconut. Oh my God. They're heaven. And they were £4 for this box. So... I will put this in the Christmas pile to put out in a little tray or a little pot or something. The rest is all booze for Christmas. Um, oh, I did get some after eights because apparently Poppy and Kaylee love them. And that's it. I'm so tired. <laughs> you know when you're just looking at it and you're like, <laughs> I'll show you where this gonk's going. Come with me. I've got to take his tag off though. He's got a tag on the back. And then I can put the Christmas tree lights on, put the stuff away, and be done. 
watch a Christmas film. Right, so these are the trees I got from Poundland a little while ago and I thought he could go in the middle like that. What do you reckon? A gonk between two trees. <laughs> Have you seen uh, Poppy's shelf with all her ducks on it? I can't remember if I showed you or not. But she's got some room for some new ones. That's just as well. Right, I've left them there for Mark to do when he gets in because it's just too heavy and I'm too tired. But I thought I'd show you the new bedding. So I put it the other way around. Um, you can have this side, which is the green side, which I like too. I'm not quite sure about these little cherubs, but I do like this side with all the holly and things on. But when I turned it over, I thought, oh, do you know, I really love that mustardy, goldy colour. So I decided to go with that this time. And then another week, I can change it to the green. But it goes, the gold also goes quite well with the little gold in the, in the snowflakes. So that's our new Christmas bedding. Um, also, I haven't shown you what Pippin's been up to. Pippin's been very naughty again. And the reindeer is now called Frank. Frank won the vote, so whoever said Frank, well done, you won the vote, but thank you for all your suggestions. <laughs> so here he is, naughty reindeer Frank this time. Frank has trapped Pippin in a glass. So, and he's sitting on it. So it's naughty Frank, not naughty Pippin this time. Although Pippin may have antagonised him to make him do it. show you all the ones that I've done all the slices of wood um, so I just get all my ideas off Pinterest so there's that one there's Holly and there's a snowman there's ho 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 with a candy cane there's a winter woods which I quite like the let it snow Joy and the snowman so I've done all those and I've got my piece of wood here that I got from the forest and now I've got two pounds <laughs> caught up in everything two um, reels of ribbon that I got from Byford's one red one green and I'm just gonna cut different lengths of ribbon thread through the hole and hang them off of this piece of wood. I have no idea where it's going yet. No idea whatsoever. <laughs> um, I'll find somewhere for it. So hopefully these will fit through, yeah. Like this. And I'm going to attach it to the wood. And I'm just gonna put them all on. It's just a nice little rustic decoration. I do like rustic decorations. Right, I have finished. I flipping love it. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but it's a decoration and I love it. Um, I will find somewhere to hang this. I'm gonna have to walk around the bungalow now until I can find a spot for it to go on. It might have to replace a picture, but I will find somewhere and then I will show you. Right, found a home for it on top of the curtain pole. <laughs> So I did want to put it on my big mirror in the hall, but I would have had to put the mirror forwards to let it stay. And that was a bit dodgy. So it's just balanced up here and it's taken me ages to get them all facing the right way. But I really like it. I just think it's something a bit different and it's something that I've made and I like it. So 
I did balance it on this lampshade as well, which worked. But you think, we've got like 10 people sitting here Christmas Day. It's just going to be knocked off, isn't it? So it's safest up there as long as no one attempts to shut the curtains. We don't shut the curtains at night, so it should be fine. Let me know what you think in the comments to my, my little uh, whatever it is. Christmas decoration, we'll call it. <laughs> right, I thought before I sign out for today, we'll do my advent calendar. So it's the 5th today because it's Mark's dad's birthday. And it's his sister's birthday tomorrow. Oh, we've got another white one. I like the white ones. I like all of them, to be honest. Right, let's get the picture one up. Picture, picture, as Gary C would say. Number five. Where are you? Uh, that didn't sound good. I'm hoping that wasn't my decoration that just fell off. Oh, there it is. Right on the house sign. Oh, it's a reef. It's a big reef. There we go. I just watched a really good film. It was on um, Prime Video, which is like Amazon Prime. And let me just see what it was called because I'm making a note I'm making a note of uh, all the Christmas films that I'm enjoying to share with you it was called Your Christmas or Mine it was on Prime Video so definitely worth a check out if you've got Prime Video anyway I've realised that I've got to edit now <laughs> because tomorrow I'm really busy and I've also got um, I'm at my mum's doing their decorations and having lunch with them so what I'm going to say is that I'm going to include mum's decorating vlog in your next upload which will be Friday <laughs> I've still not got to grips with all this um, vlogmas yet but yeah I think it will be on Friday so I'm going to include that in that one um, and just do Sundays and Mondays vlogs today so i'm going to edit this now so i'm going to say goodbye hope you've enjoyed it give it a thumbs up thank you for supporting my vlogmas i'm enjoying doing it i've just got to keep remembering to pick the camera up <laughs> and um i shall see you all on friday for the next upload bye <laughs>